Welcome to the Miracles and Science Center for Continuous Personal and Professional Development. Today, the 7th of July, again, I come with another day life lesson. So, this day life lesson tells us that we should always remain positive, even when times appear to be messy. Even when we find ourselves in a messy situation, either we have brought ourselves into that mess, or others have put ourselves in those different messing situations. So, what this day life lesson tells us is that you should remain positive. And it will take you through a number of ways how you can be able to remain positive in those situations when things are messed up. Before I go into the details of these different ways, I remind you to subscribe to the Miracles and Science TV on YouTube for you to be able to get the previous daily life lessons and those that you will be able to post in the future. So, the three different ways how you can remain positive when things are messy. Number one, it is important for you to have a positive life philosophy. For example, the life philosophy of a positive-minded person is that in the end, everything will be fine. If everything is not fine, then it is not the end. So if you believe in that, it will help you to remain positive in the different situations that you find up yourself in. In a messy situation you find yourself in, you remain positive with that kind of philosophy. Number two, it is important for you to remember that the different messed up situations that you find yourself in can be actually addressed through planning. So for you to be able to plan a way out, it is important to know that that particular plan will actually be there. So in Philippines, in the Bible, it gives us indications that you should not be anxious. Always, for example, plan. But of course, before you plan, you pray so that eventually a solution will be found. So don't sit down, crave, and find yourself not be able to move ahead because of the messy situation. So get to know that when you plan, then eventually you'll be able to address that situation. Reason number three why you should be able to be positive in that situation is because you should know that there will be a plan that will come your way, especially when you have a positive kind of thinking in a way that the negative can be addressed by the positive. Meaning that when you are positive and have a positive mentality, eventually you'll be able to address the negative. The negative will go away all the run off. So for these three reasons, that's why it is important for you to remain positive even in messy kind of situations. I remind you to once again subscribe to the Miracles and Science TV channel for any of the daily lessons that you'll post and those ones that I have already posted in the past. This has been a daily lesson for today.